Hi everybody and thanks for joining. Uh, my name is Seb Francis and I'm with Titus Learning. Today we're going to look at how to add an RSS feed to your Moodle site. Now RSS feeds are particularly useful for teachers of courses um, where they want to get a news feed that is relevant and, and, and specific to the topic that they're teaching, uh, just as a bit of added content for the course. Um, so in this example we're going to go through to one of our courses um, and show how that would be done as a teacher. So first thing we do is turn editing on and then scroll to the bottom of our blocks on the left hand side to add a new block and we're going to select RSS block from it. So if you can't see this for any reason then have a chat either with your administrator in school, have a chat with your Moodle support provider and they can make sure that that's enabled and you can access it. Um, and as you can see we've just added that up here, the remote news feed. So the first thing we're going to do is click on the little settings cog and then click configure and this is going to allow us to either add a new news feed or select from one that we've already added and, and made available on Moodle. So you can see there are a few here that we could select that we've added previously. Um, for this example to show you how it's done we're going to add a new feed so just click yes leave this page and you get taken to where you can manage your, your all the rest of your feed so click add a new feed custom title here so this is going to be BBC Education and we've gone off already and all it did was, was Google BBC News Education RSS feed and it will take you through to this um, just as other, other feeds will do as well and you can see here how you can subscribe to this feed so we know that we just need to copy and paste the URL which is just up top. So once you've got that, paste that in we're going to click shared feed so that other teachers can access it as well so if you are adding things on there really useful to be able to share a few resources with teachers and, and reduce the workload so we'll click shared in this example add a new feed and you'll see you've now got that there added the BBC Education one just here second in the list. So if we go back through to our course now, now that we've got the, the relevant feed added and go through that similar process again of clicking configure then you can see we've got our BBC Education one which has just been added um, you've got a few configuration settings around how the, the, the block is displayed so the number of entries that are shown, the title if necessary um, and then links through to the original sites as well. So you can change these if you wish, have a little play around so it suits your, your course page. I'm just going to go to the bottom and click Save Changes. And back on our page, we can now see that the feeds are starting to be pulled through. Um, obviously if I click Turn Editing Off, you've still got them there and then if we need to click onto one of those feeds, it'll actually take us off to that BBC News story um, as well. And you can put the descriptions on here so there's a bit more information. So that is how to add an RSS feed to your Moodle. Um, as always, any questions or comments, feel free to, to get in touch. And I hope you tune back in with us soon. Thanks a lot.